We've just made it out the St. Peter's Basilica Church. And it is massive. It's huge. It's a little bit bigger than Tams. <laughs> it's really big in there and it's, I think it is like the biggest church we've seen. So we only saw a very small fraction of what's inside and it is massive. There's so many art pieces we couldn't even record all of them. You're just going to have to see a snippet of what we really saw. From what we already saw, it's actually quite a lot to take in already. Mm. So I can't imagine going through the museum and everything after this. I'm just fixing her hair quick for the camera. Are you good, Tams? I'm good. Let me fix my hair quick. <laughs> mm, very good. We made it to the Vatican Museum. And unfortunately, when we looked online now, all the tickets were sold out. So we are either have to wait in a line, which is highly unlikely. Because it's really long. We're going to go th back to St. Peter's Basilica because apparently the Pope addresses an audience at... Between 9 and 11 on a Wednesday. And today's Wednesday. That's if he's in the country though. So hopefully he's in the country. So we're on our way back now. We're back, but I don't see the Pope. Sam's got us tickets. Woo! There was a nice lady who gave us two tickets. We're gonna go see the Pope. <laughs> you know, you so cool. I think Taryn's just happy because she got something for free. <laughs> it is free. I just had to, we didn't order it. Yeah, we, you have to like, I don't know how you order the tickets, but you order the tickets, they are free. But yeah, we didn't know how to do it, so it was great to have someone just give it to us. This is the queue to go see the Pope. It's crazy. To see the Pope is like going through airport security. We made it in. The whole process was only 10 minutes, and now we're going inside to see the Pope. <laughs> His Holiness also intends to bless any religious articles you may have brought for this purpose. Wow, that was crazy. That was an interesting experience. It was like, not a mask. It was like a chilling session. Yeah. He'd say, I'm greeting everyone in everyone English. Everyone start screaming. <gasps> greeting everyone in Spain. <laughs> Tams didn't know it was a mass. She thought we were going in to get a selfie with the Pope. <laughs> well, not a selfie, but I thought we were like meeting the Pope and that everyone would just like get a blessing and walking past. I don't know, it was like a real mass thing. And now everyone had ran to the Pope to go get stuff signed and blessed. But oh my word. I don't think signed, Tams. It's not an autograph. <laughs> but, but blessed. It's insane. <laughs> There's like way over 10,000 people in there. Yeah. Like, I don't even know how you'd reach him. We were so far. <laughs> So we're ending our tour here of the Vatican City and just an interesting fact is in 1929 the Vatican City was actually formed as a spiritual center of the Catholic Church and this is where the Pope resides. So yeah, and it's actually the smallest country in the world of 44 hectares. <laughs> <laughs> 